Today, Navy Recognition Editorial Team will focus its attention on the Australian Hunter class frigates. In this video, we will review the Vessel Futures equipment, so we hope you will enjoy it. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to be informed of the latest news. For the record, in December 2018, the Australian government signed the head contract with ASC Shipbuilding, a subsidiary of BAE System Australia, to build the Hunter class frigates under Project C5000 Phase 1. According to the Royal Australian Navy, the Hunter class frigate program will provide nine frigates optimized for anti submarine warfare. These new vessels will replace the Anza class frigates based on the UK's Type 26 Global Combat Ship. The Hunter class will have the capability to conduct a variety of missions independently or as part of a task group, with sufficient range and endurance to operate effectively throughout the region. The frigates will also have the flexibility to support non-warfare roles such as humanitarian assistance and disaster relief. The class will have a 8,800 tonne full load displacement and will be approximately 150 meters in length. The vessel will be capable of sailing in excess of 27 knots and will have a full complement of 180 crew. Regarding the equipment on board, the Hunter class frigate will be armed with one Mark 45 Mod 4 dual purpose gun, a Mark 41 vertical launch system able to fire RIM 66 Standard 2 and RIM 162 ESSM missiles, plus 2x4 canister advanced anti-ship missiles, two phalanx closing weapon systems, two 30mm short-range gun systems and MU-90 impact torpedoes. Moreover, the Hunter class frigates will be able to carry one MH-60R ASW helicopter and has the ability to host other Australian aircraft such as the MRH-90 helicopter. Well, keep in mind that Defense Web TV has more than 1,400 videos on its YouTube channel. So please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell here under to be informed of the latest defense and security news.